So the question I have is, how hard is it to download a local large language model to your computer, basically to have a local AI system on your own personal computer? I've never done it before. Let's give it a try. So for this, we're going to use the program LM Studio because I heard it was a very user friendly model, especially for beginners with AI. And you can download all of these uh, models after you download this program just by clicking the windows here, which I've actually already done. So here you can see I've downloaded it a couple times. We're just going to click the first one, the execute file here. It'll walk us through the installation process. So once I click on that, this is just for me. So that's going to be that. If you want to add others, you can, but just click next. Here's the location. Here's the gig and file size. Not too bad. Click next Do the TV magic. We're done. And then uh, we're actually going to finish this and close this out. And you, I want to access it through my actual desktop. So here is the desktop. We'll click on that. It'll open into the environment. From here, you can go to the top is where you're actually going to select your LLM model. And the one that I actually want to use is called Quen3. Kind of wanted to play with it and see what it looked like. So once I type that in and click search, you'll see that it opens up into this screen, which shows all of the staff picks. Now, this is from Hugging Face. So you can select different models from DeepSeek to OpenAI to Quen, which is what I'm looking for here. Uh, make sure you're picking a trusted model on here as well. What I'm looking for is the Quen3 VI 30 billion parameter one, which is right here. And once I click on that, a download option will be selected here. And once you click on that, the download will take a little bit of time. It's a huge file. So one of the big things I want to mention too is that I'm using a uh, NVIDIA graphics uh, 5070 Ti. So it's important you're going to need that kind of power to run this large of a model. Okay, so after the download was complete, uh, I turned on light mode here, but this is what it looks like. And I just go up here to select a model, which I downloaded, which is the Quen VI3 here. I guess I just click on that. All right, it's gonna load that model. All right, it looks like it's uh, good to go. So I'll go down here and we can ask it a question. I'll ask it something like, uh, let's say, how tall is the empire? Once I can type. Empire State Building. Well, look at that. I now have my own personal AI on my computer, local. That is very interesting. Easier than I thought it was going to be. So hopefully that helps. Thanks, everybody.